with the red-headed lip and eye. Oh, we got some bluegill attention there. So you can't get a big old bass to come out. There we go. Here's the bass. There you go, folks. You see that? Oh, yeah. That's some bass fishing right there, buddy. See, when it takes this, you just got to go through and find the right bait for the fish. And here we got a nice little bass. Nice little bass. Not too shabby. He's about 11 inches. It's oversized. We're gonna throw him back. It's right in that mess you wanna go. If that is where they're gonna hide. They're gonna hide right in there and they're gonna. There we go. There's another nice one. Got another little guy. Ooh, fight it. Let's fight. He likes it. He doesn't want to let go. Yeah. There we go. Come on, buddy. And there's another little bag. Because I'm attacked by flies trying to get into my bait. Another little bass. Let's run back in the water. There's one thing not to do if you buy expensive fishing equipment, just smack it around. I buy cheap stuff because I'm a cheap guy. It's going to catch the same kind of fish. Doesn't matter if it's a $300 rod or a $5 rod, it's going to catch the same kind of fish. But I'm not supposed to tell you that because I might have sponsors. Yeah, right. I might be sponsored by some $300 outfit. And then they already said, hey, it don't matter if it's $300 or $5. It don't. Never has, never will. I'm just getting out of here.